storm, the fire come through. I'm up at deep water here at Matchbox Road and um, come through it was just yeah, unbelievable really. We're visiting Ben uh, as a call out. He was re-evacuated uh, when the fires uh, came through his property. He obviously has left the property without any sort of ID identification or that sort of thing. Luckily he had registered. All we needed to do today was come back out, get some ID from him so that he can uh, go through the portal and obviously ask if there was anything else we could assist him with as far as his property goes. Oh, the roar, the roar of the fire. That's something, yeah, you can't really explain that. It's, yeah, like, it sounds like a train, to be honest. A nice sort of rumble, growl, or sort of. That was, that got the, that got the goosebumps up. That did, yeah. In fact, the same area, uh, Christine and I was called up to uh, do similar work like we're doing today, but it was for a flood during that time. Battle Creek, Deep Water, uh, even Agnes Waters at that time. Yeah, the, the smoke got pretty bad a couple of days beforehand and they took the dogs and that and, and left, so I'd done the, the silly thing of staying and seeing what I could do really, just yeah, save the house, save the cows. It's, it's been amazing. The community, the, everyone's just come together like a big family. It's good to know that, yeah, it, when stuff like this happens, that uh, we, we step up. It gets emotional. Not at all, yeah, it gets, it's, yeah, it's lovely. Mm -hmm.